All engines require regular servicing to help keep their internals well lubricated and to remove all the metal particles, carbon deposits and other debris caused by normal engine wear through its life. We recommend an oil and filter change at least every 10,000 miles or once a year for any vehicle. In the case of an engine ran by a wet belt rather than a conventional timing belt, this is a lot more important. A wet belt is situated inside the engine and is covered in engine oil, hence its name, wet belt. Car manufacturers will recommend the oil grades for all their vehicles and most garages follow these recommendations when servicing vehicles. But what they don't always follow is the specifications of that grade of oil. In the case of most petrol cars, the specifications aren't that important. Yes, they may help prevent a bit of carbon buildup in the engine, but if you have your car serviced either annually or every 10,000 miles, this will be minimal. In the case of an engine ran by a wet belt, however, the specification is very important. Specification is what looks after the wet belt. It's what stops it from prematurely aging over time and overheating. When the wet belt prematurely degrades, it starts to break down. Small fragments of rubber break off and are carried by the oil to the oil pump. Then over time, they block the oil pump and cause it to suffocate. This prevents the oil from getting around the engine and eventually causing serious engine damage. 